Hello there, this is Russ Buecher from Control My Nikon, and in this video we're going to take a look at how you can trigger the shutter using a web browser that can be on your computer or device such as a smartphone or tablet. Let's give it a try. So first we need to go up to Triggers to Web. So let's bring it up and give it a try and then we'll try to configure it. So first of all, we'll click on Enable and this is essentially a web server that you've now started within Control My Nikon. And your web page on your smartphone or tablet or your computer is going to access this web server at this address and this port. Now to test it, we just need to click on Test and it brings up your default web browser, which in this case is Chrome on this computer. And we can see that the test web page brought up this address which is what we had here. So if you were to use a different address to host your web server on, then you need to change the address here at all. And I'm just going to uh, make a shortcut to this. By default, you'll see there's several different buttons here. And uh, this is where we display which buttons are shown in the web page. So connect, disconnect, shoot, start, and stop recording. I'm just going to remove the recording buttons here. So you can double click on them or use these buttons to move them. And you can pick any of these actions. So once you have made changes to the list, you should save your profile because the commands you have displayed on the web page are stored within the profile. So I'm in the default profile, I'll click on save, or you can use control S on the keyboard. Now these buttons are very large here and they look extremely large on a computer monitor, but they're meant to be large like this so they're big enough to touch on a tablet or a smartphone. All right, so let's try disconnecting. Okay, connect. And I'll shoot. And you can see it capture the images. And it shows the log here, showing the commands that it received from the web browser. Now, if you have problems connecting to this from your web browser, double check your firewall settings on your computer that it allows access from your web browser, wherever that may be, to this computer. So if you have your smartphone with you and the network, you now have a remote for your camera. And that's it. That's how you set up web triggers in Control My Icon. Happy tethering.